Hi, let me show you some code. Here, we rewrite our running example with async and await keywords. Note that these keywords are available in node version 8, but not in node version 6. So we skip the helper function extract title and make body promise. And look at uh, concatenate. So we decorate the function concatenate with the async keyword. Its body contains a loop iterating over the URLs and awaiting the associated page, extracting the title from this page and pushing the title over the title's hash table. The result is a promise to which we can attach a SQL to process the gathered titles as we may see here. Observe also the makeBodyPromise function, the various protections we set against errors. The try-catch is useful if the URL is malformed. It is caught here. The request on error is useful, for instance, if the URL designate a site that doesn't exist, so you cannot resolve its name. And the response on error is useful in case of a network problem while downloading the page. Another version of concatenate is concatenate all that offers more concurrency since we use a promise all promise which returns the array of associated pages. The rest of the code is pretty simple. However, with this code, the first error makes the whole process fail, since promise all fails as soon as one of its promises is rejected. So this is what we see when run. We get the empty table here. 